eat? I have a lot to think about. I burned dinner. I'm sorry. Not my dinner. My dinner was fine. Your dinner. I put it back in the oven and I turned it up as high as it could go and I watched as it turned black. It's still hot. Very hot. Want it? You didn't have to do that. I know. It just seemed like the kind of thing a mentally deranged, sex-starved, pill-popping housewife would do. Uh -huh. So, I did it. Who knows what I have to do anymore. How many pills? A bunch. Don't change the subject. I'm not going to talk to you when you're like this. No, no. Don't you do that. I'm... I'm fine. The pills are not the problem, not our problem. I want to know where you've been. I want to know what's going on. That's what? The job? Not the I job. I told you I needed more time. Not the job. I talked to Mr. Tom on the phone. He said not that I needed to hurry up. I cannot talk to you sensibly about anything when you are like Shut up! <sighs> then what? Stick to the subject. I don't know what that is. If you have something you want to ask me, then go ahead and ask. Ask! I... I can't. I'm scared of you. I'm tired. I'm going to bed. Tell me without making me ask. Please. This is insane. I don't know what you're asking. When you come through the door at night, you're... You're never exactly as I remember you. You... I'm, I'm surprised by by something mean and hard about the way you look. Even even the weight of you in the bed at night, the way you breathe when you sleep. It's unfamiliar. You terrify me. Well, I know who you are. <laughs> yes. I'm the enemy. That's easy. That doesn't change. You think you're the only one who hates sex? I do. I hate it with you. I do. I dream that you batter away at me until my joints come apart like wax and I fall into pieces. It's like a punishment. It was wrong of me to marry you. I knew you were. It's, it's a sin. Telling us both. And I can always tell when you've taken too many pills. You get all red faced and sweaty, and quite frankly, that's oftentimes why I don't. Because. You're not pretty. But not like this. There's something to ask you. Then ask me, Jesus! Are you? If you try to walk out, I will put your dinner back in the oven and I will turn it up so high that the whole building will fill with smoke and everyone in it will asphyxiate. So help me God, I will. Now answer the question. What if... Tell me. And we'll see. No. I'm not. I don't see what difference it makes. I think we ought to pray. Let's ask God. Let's, let's ask Him together. God won't talk to me. You have to make up people to talk to me. To keep asking. I can't remember the question. Oh, yeah, God. Stop! My... Stop! Stop it! I'm warning you. What difference does it make if I'm one thing deep within? No matter how wrong or ugly that thing is. So long as I fought with everything in me to kill it. What do you want from me, Harper? God, what do you want from me? More than that. For God's sake, I'm a shell. There's nothing left to kill. So long as my behavior is what I know it has to be. Good. Decent. That alone in the eyes of God is enough. No, no, God, that's, that's Utah talk, Mormon talk. I hate it, Joe. Just, just tell me. Say it. All I will say is that I'm a good man. 
You have worked very hard to become a good man. You want to destroy that. You want to destroy me, and I, I'm not going to let you do it. I'm going to have a baby. Liar. You liar. A baby born addicted to pills. A baby who doesn't see, but who hallucinates. Who looks it up, up at us with big mirror eyes and who doesn't know who we are. Are you really? No. Yes. No. Yes. Get away from me. Now we both have a secret. <laughs>